Welcome back to Good Day State Line. Brecken Hawk from Associated Bank is joining us this morning. Good morning, Brecken. Good morning. Thank you so much for coming in. Thanks for having me. So we want to talk about private banking, and first we need to know what that means. So tell us uh, what private banking sure. is. Sure. As a private banker, I work with high net worth individuals, families, business owners. Um, primarily, I focus on deposit, customized lending, um, but it's also great to have the relationships and understand the full picture, financial picture, to be able to help the clients reach their goals. Which is very important, especially when yes. it comes to finances. You have goals, you want to yes. achieve them. It's hard to do that by yourself. Correct. That's why we need you. Correct. Speaking of, so how did you land this career? How did? What's your path here? So I've been in banking for many years. I've been a private banker for a little over 10 years. Um, and I would say the most important part is just working with the clients, mm -hmm. having the relationship. No client situation is the same. Everyone is different, which is a lot of fun. And Associated Bank is a big enough organization to have resources, but yet to deliver it locally is huge and be able to touch the clients. Um, in Rockford, we have a trust and investment right here in Rockford, local people. Someone that works with um, retirement plan services mm -hmm. for our companies. I'm really close with our commercial bankers um, to be able to help those business owners and not to mention the retail footprint that we have and our great employees there that help our clients every single day. So much of that is so important and much like every industry, uh, this year has changed due to yes. COVID-19. So how has it changed for you banking wise and how you interact with the community? Sure, um, COVID's changed a lot. <laughs> um, I would say, you know, our lobbies are currently closed. Right but we're definitely open for business. Our drive ups are, you know, we can do a lot more transactions now through the drive up. Mm -hmm. We have clients come into the offices that are comfortable. They just have to make an appointment or sure. go online and make an appointment. I would say the way I interact with some of my clients has been a lot of Skype meetings, <laughs> which I'm sure you can understand yeah. and appreciate. Um, conference calls, however the clients want to interact. Um, we've been able to expand our mobile app so clients can get statements off of there. So we're really touching our clients, communicating all the time, just in different ways. You know, I hate to say positive things from the pandemic, but I think everyone knows what I mean when I say that. But mobile apps and learning all of these new technologies and yes. implementing them in different parts of our lives is kind of awesome. Yes. So especially when it comes to yes. money and banking, because if you think back years and years ago, you know, you would have to print out your statement if it was online, or you would have to, you know, wait for it to come in the mail. Right. Which right. I know my parents have boxes of bank statements <laughs> in the basement at their yes. house. And so now yes. we have it on our phone. And, and to be honest, I mean, that helps clients too um, with, you know, people thieves, really, sure. you know, and so much fraud going on, being able to monitor and look at it every day as opposed to waiting for a bake statement to come into the mail is is huge and it's good that more people are doing it. Absolutely. So tell me a little bit about your United Way campaign. So our United Way campaign is one of our biggest campaigns throughout the year and it's a ton of fun. We have so much fun with our United Way campaign and love our partnership with mm -hmm. United Way. So we typically this year, or I should say last year in um, 2019 was very successful and it led right into this year, which was great. Our branches get baskets together, we raise money by you know raffling those off. Mm -hmm. um, we still did all of that this year with COVID, which was great. Yeah. And we were also able to donate $10,000 to the United Way COVID Relief Fund. Wow. So That's awesome. it, it's been great. And our employees still had a 95% participation rate this year. That is so great. So how do you encourage your employees to get involved in the community? Associated Bank has always believed that their employees should be involved and dedicated to the communities in which they serve. And I think it's important to find something that you're passionate about and get involved in the community. We were very successful um, many years, even last year. We have about 65 employees within the Rockford Beloit market and they volunteered 2,450 hours last year wow. that were logged. So that's huge, and we've been growing um, year after year. I this, love that. Yeah, this year with COVID, we'll, we'll finish up right around 1,000, but we're really, really proud of that. Perfect. Um, just because in the past, we do yard cleanup for non-for-profits and things like that, and you'd send a team of 20. Now you're only sending a team of three, <laughs> so that, that Changes but things the best a little three bit. Still count exactly. For sure. Exactly. Um, so, Brecken, tell us if anyone wants to get more on Associated Bank, where can we go? Um, just go to our website, and you can get more information there. Um, give any of the branches a call. Perfect. And 
Thank yeah. you. Thank You're you. Welcome. Thank you so much for joining us today. Thank you so much. <laughs> Coming up next, we are talking with Miss Carly here in the studio, and then we're going to give you some great deals on holiday gadgets for the entire family. But first, it's birthday time. Tomorrow, we're wishing Ashley a happy birthday. And on Tuesday, happy birthday to my brother, Michael. You might have seen him on this week's Wine Wednesday. He's turning 36. And on Friday, we are sending a huge happy birthday to Kelly Latimer, who is our general manager here at the TV station. We hope you have a wonderful day. Send us your birthday shout-outs at gooddaystateline at WTVO.com. We'll be right back.